Hey friends, how are you? Peggy Rojas here. Today I want to share with you one of the best tools that you can use for your, to grow your business and maximize your time. Because what are we here for is to get a better result, better results, improve our business productivity, and at the same time having fun. So these type forms are not meant to replace the relationship that you are growing with your future challenger. Instead, it's giving you the tools so you can help them better. So when you introduce the tool, make sure you ask them, hey, is that okay if I share with you this form? Or you can add this form to your blog, to your like pages, to your Instagram. When you, po you post an invitation, hey, if you're interested in joining me, just fill out this form. And then make sure you follow up. I'm gonna share how you can create this form by sharing my screen really quick. And basically, you will go to, I'm going to log out of here. You go to typeform.com, and then you're going to create a free account. I'm just going to log in, and I'm going to share with you how you can create your own type form. So you go to create a new type form, click there, start from scratch, and you put a name. I'm going to call it new um, detox um, friend, uh, detox group, okay? Uh, you can pick the, you can pick actually the language and you can put in Spanish if you want. So English and start building. So my detox group is right here. All these options on your left are the type of questions and options you can put to create your form. Example, for uh, your welcome screen, you add a welcome screen and will say, hey, welcome to blah, blah, blah. Welcome text goes here. So thank you for taking three minutes of your time of your time to share with me your goals. You can put your fitness goals. Okay. And they can press start. You can change that uh, to press here. Whatever it best works for you. You can also add a small description under it. Don't make it too complicated. And you can add a, an image. I like to add images. It makes it like more professional. So I'm going to add an image and I'm going to upload it here and I'm going to use our team uh, logo because we have that image now available. Boom. How professional that looks. Okay. So we had the first step. Then things that you need to know from that person. I will choose the short text to add name. What's your name or first name? Right, and I make a go here to settings and I make this required and I saved. And then I put uh, another short text for, you know what, I'm gonna put email. And if you click here, you can add a variable, say, hey, in your user first name, please share with me your email. So the name will show there and it will look super cool for that person to be called by her name. First name and then uh, let's say Yolanda. Um, please um, give me your email. And then in description, I'm gonna say, I promise I won't um, spam you. Happy face. Okay, I make this required. So the person cannot go into the next question until she finished that. And another short, it's what's your uh, name in Facebook? Because hey, sometimes in that, and I said Facebook because this is the tool that I use the most um, in social media. So what's your name in Facebook? And sometimes that changes. And I'm totally lost when I receive the form and I don't know who to contact back, right? So, and I put this required, save. Another question, you want to know which are the fitness goals. 
But for this, I'm going to add some specific options. So I'm going to um, pick the multiple choice, okay? The, and I'm going to call that person by their first name. Can you, um, which are your goals? Are your goals? And then I have eight options, okay? First, lose uh, five to 10 pounds. Add the second one. Lose 10 to 20 pounds. Um, to 20 pounds. And then add 20, okay, 20 or more. Then I'm gonna add another that says um, medical reasons. And then the last one, all of the above. Okay, so I'm gonna save this. Then I am going to ask them if they have any uh, problems with their health, right? So I'm gonna do uh, multiple choice. No, I'm gonna give them a long text. Tell me, do you have any, do you have any health issues? And I put example, uh, high blood pressure, um, diabetes, back problems, back knee problems, etc. And of course, I'm going to make it required, saved. I need this information. And then I'm going to say, uh, how about any allergies? Do you have allergies? Short text. Do you have any allergies? Required. And one of the, the most important ones, hey, and I'm gonna call her name. Are you currently working with a beach body coach, with a coach? I'm gonna say a coach. Require, and this could be yes or no. Hold on, this make it easier. Yes or no. Are you currently working with another coach come on another coach and of course require because if they're already working with another coach i will not take them i'm gonna ask that coach to go back to the upline and join any of the challengers one of the questions and i'll say yes or no are you willing to invest in your health, invest in your health. Require yes or no. It will give you, you know, if that person says yes, uh, says yes, you're gonna go back and say, since you said you were um, interested in investing in your health, let me share with you these options. And um, there will be less, what I'm trying to accomplish with this form also is to uh, touch the, um, the things that they normally, um, say they're, they're not willing to buy a challenge pack because they don't have money or maybe they have back problems, but here you're gonna have all the tools to go back and give them a better explanation and a more and an option that is more suitable to their needs. Make sense? Okay, so opinion scale. So, and I'm gonna add her name. From one to 10, 10, 10 being amazing, how will you rate your nutrition? This is very important. Okay, and again, I'm gonna make a require, save. Actually, I can change that. See how it allows you to put a, uh, not good, and then very good. So 
how I'm just gonna put her first name and then delete this part. How will you rate your nutrition? How about that? Save, perfect. See how easy it is and it looks so amazing in their phones and their screens when they see this. What else would you like to ask? You, you can ask many other things, but I will say keep it simple, short and sweet. Um, another thing that I like to ask is um, which are your biggest challenges? So I'm going to give them multiple choices. Which are the biggest your biggest why are you which are your biggest challenges and i'm gonna put like time there's money lack of motivation lack of discipline and i can say others okay Again, I'm going to make it um, require. And if, you know, if I delete this one other and I add this other option, they will be able to type their older option. Make sense? And that's pretty much it. Um, how would you like to be um, contacted? So I'm going to give them a drop. Oh, that's limited to the free ones. So that's it, 10 questions. How is that? Another thing that I like to do is just um, view my form. It's, it's ready. You can view your type form and make sure everything is okay. This is how it's gonna start. And you say press here and you can scroll down, see how it is required. So put my name and say, hey, Peggy. And you can do it, um, oh, it's, at gmail.com, see how it's calling my name on top? I misspelled it, but yeah. What's your name in face? Peggy Conde, actually. Which is, uh, how want to lose that? And do you have any issues? No. And do you have any allergies? No. Are you currently working with another coach? No. Are you willing to invest? Yes. Uh, Peg, how will you rate your nutrition? No, nah, it's kidding, I'm like four which is your biggest time and then submit. You will get your response so fast. And I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna go back into my workplace. When you log in, this is your workplace. And you're gonna be able to see the answers. So you see how a detox group is right here. You press on analyze and then to left, you will see results. You can see how many people visit your page and how average the time was. So my results are right here. So when you call this person or email this person, you're gonna say, hey Peg, thank you for sharing with you and I will go to their Facebook and like on their things, trying to be more social to that person, make them know that I am there, I'm watching. I, I understand you want to lose between five to 10 pounds and you don't have any health issues and you don't have any allergies. You are not currently any, working with any other co coach, um, but you're willing to invest in your health. Let me tell you about the options I have for you that will help you to reach your goal of losing five to 10 pounds in, and then you add the time, realistically, how much it will take her to lose those five, 10 pounds, maybe, 30 days, 60 days, a year. And then you're gonna send them an email with your canna response. I hope you like this. I'm gonna start my share. And this is the first step to make it easier. You can have many answers there and you can go back and every time you want to follow up with somebody, you have all the information there. So you can maybe next, they tell you not this time, but maybe next month, next month, you call them, contact them and say, hey, you told me last time that you wanted to lose five to 10 pounds. Can I help you now? Are you ready? And then start the conversations. That's all for now. Peggy Rojas here. I hope you like this. Share your comments. Bye.